what's going on guys in today's video we got the Ulanzi G95 I got this for my GoPro 9 and we're gonna be doing an unboxing right now So if you want to be part of the family here, click that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you won't miss another one of our videos when we upload it. Plenty of good content. We have lots of videos coming up. In today's video, we got the Ulanzi G95. All right, guys, so I bought this to be used with my GoPro 9. Let's open up and see what we get. Let's see what all we get. screws for it, Allen wrench, GoPro feet if you plan on using those, these don't fold up, of course they're stationary, now this case is all metal, that's something that I liked, it wasn't a plastic, I think that's pretty cool comes wrapped in all this bubble wrap Let's get rid of that okay so everything's pretty much on here already and this can go on the bottom so you can use all your GoPro mounts but what I thought that I like it's got the quarter screw in so that you can use it with a tripod of your choice or whatever you want screw that right in there this also will take the microphone adapter piece so you can plug it here and then plug it into the side and I like this case right here because when the GoPro is in here it has to pass through and you can charge it without having to take this off all the time if you need this off obviously you can have it off because it goes in in the front so there's really not an issue with how this goes so to get it on back on there it's push up kind of locks in down and away and there you go down and away got these little rails And this also, you can take it off and have that separate. You still got your cold shoe mount there. You got one on the side so that you can put your microphone, your a light, couple lights if you didn't need an extra mic. And if you didn't need the external mic, then you wouldn't need to get a extra piece to put here it just depends on what you want to do but this is like solid metal I mean you can hear it all metal I mean this is, this is really strong you're not gonna break it so this would protect it I would say even from a pretty good size fall I mean GoPro is tough enough this backs it up makes it extremely tough now put your GoPro in this slides off Put your GoPro in. This goes back on there, and you're good to go. So I got my GoPro here. It's on this little stand, and one of the things that I don't care for is having to unscrew this all the time. If you want to take that off, And so right now, you know, sometimes I have this off, I'm shooting a couple things and I just plug it in. So I don't even have the door on it. And why? Because, you know, I had it in something else and I didn't need the door on there. So the good thing is I already took it off. So I'm already ready for this. This comes off the back. This is going to slide in there. Now, it's got a nice little grip right here. It's got a grip on the side. See that? Okay, so it's, 
it's a snug fit when you get it in there. And once you work it in there just right, Turn it back off. Yeah. Let's take the uh, door off just so we can uh, get a little more clearance. I think that was the problem. I took the door off and it gave because it's got the uh, snug fit piece there. But I took the door off and it let me slide it in there. So that's something you're going to have to do. Take the door off to get it in there. Now it's in there and you just seal it back with this piece. Snaps in the place and there you go. I mean this this is pretty solid. Now you put your door that they give you back on there. Now your regular door, of course, you're just gonna keep it for you know whatever another you know if you're not having it if you don't have it in here you're gonna need your other door back but it's got that push down there we go it's a little snug as you see to try to get it in there so it's a little cumbersome but that's part of it being the way that it is it just really gets in there good once you once you get it in there so it's it's nice and snug you see it don't rattle there's nothing going on i don't think i'm going to add the extra piece to it because where i already had this one this mini tripod i'm going to just take that piece off okay and this is uh how i normally mess around with this. I, this is nor normally how I would use it, camera and stuff. So I like that I could just screw it in and the screw doesn't come in the top right here. So you still have room to put the other piece, which I don't have right now. I'll probably buy that into the future as this piece right here. I bought it out of my own pocket. They did not sponsor this or give me this in any way. I actually went out and bought this myself. This is pretty much the setup, you know, just the way it is. The GoPro itself, it's got pretty good sound. It's not bad. And another reason that I bought this was for this little ring around here because this is a 52 millimeter the lenses is going to fit this really well. All right, guys, so that concludes this video. This is a very nice case. If you're considering getting this case, I would suggest getting it. It's really, really nice. It fits nice and snug in here. It's rugged. It's going to hold up. I like the look of it. It's really cool. Make sure you subscribe. That'll really help our channel out, help us grow as a channel. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button. We appreciate it. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Booyah!